You know, I really did love my mom. I wanted to be her and do everything like she did. Like how she'd stay up so late working. Yet still wake up early and prepare a homemade lunch for me every day. How she relentlessly strived to further her research. And how she'd always scold me for reading her notes. Cognitive science. What? Wait, then your mother's research was... Through one's desires, the cognitive world can become distorted. If it becomes distorted, that person will exhibit disturbing behavior. If the core of this distortion is removed, then the twisted world and its behaviors disappear. Uh, was your mother researching palaces? In my case, all I ever thought about was my mom. I became trapped in a cognitive labyrinth. Freeing myself on my own was impossible. That's why you had to steal your heart? Kind of a jump in logic. I haven't been honest with you. My goal isn't to change people's hearts. I want to learn what happened to my mom. I want to know why she was killed. She was killed? There's a line in her notes that says, Should the self in the cognitive world die, the self in the real world would lose consciousness. Is that possible? Hold on. Are the psychotic breakdowns connected? I'm not sure. But right before my mom died, she seemed different. She ignored me, no matter how hard I tried. My mom didn't jump into the road. It was like she collapsed. I investigated her notes. I read books and scoured the internet for anything I could find. I even hacked into the networks of a few research labs to take a look at their classified data. <sighs> that explains the hacking. You have a weird little mind. However, I couldn't find anything. All of my mom's research, it was nowhere to be found. Someone murdered her, and her work was treated like it never existed. I'm certain it was those adults in the black suits who faked the suicide note. And I swear, I'll never forgive them. Futaba. Missing research data on cognitive science. Do you think... Yeah. There's a chance it might be connected to a man in a black mask Kanashiro mentioned. What's more, my older sister has recently been looking into these psychotic breakdown cases. <laughs> it feels like I'm betraying her by saying this, but her findings may be beneficial. Please understand. If I join up with you, it's so I can learn about what happened. Maybe I can avenge my mom's murder. My reasons for joining you are personal and maybe even selfish. So then, is that acceptable? All that just means we can count on you, right, Mona? What are you looking at me for? You trying to say I'm not dependable? Oh, please. I would never comment on what a useless furball you are. Say it to my face, monkey! Uh, furbutt? <laughs> We're a bunch of misfits, but I hope we get along. <sighs> Thank you. It's unbelievable, though. I never thought the Phantom Thieves were this close to me. Same to you. To think you'd be the daughter of a Metaverse researcher. It's like fate. Anyway, you're the right person for the job. I think it's time to head back. Sure. Let's go home. <laughs>